hello guys so today we talk about uh, what is geomorphology and uh, types of geomorphology so in this video we also talk about the geomorphic process that involve in the forming of uh, new landforms in earth surface so here is the definition of geomorphology geomorphology is the scientific study of the origin and evolution of topographic features these features created by physical chemical or biological processes operating at or near earth surface so uh, topographic features means here uh, the features that is existed in earth surface not below the earth surface so uh, if you ask uh, uh, for a basic definitions of uh, geomorphology so it means uh, it is the study of the earth's physical features and the process in which those features are formed so what is geomorphic processes so process that shape the geomorphic features are called geomorphic process and these features generally comes into three categories first is weathering and erosion the second one is transportation of that material and its deposition so uh, geomorphic process actually involve weathering and erosion of the rock type or uh, soils and uh, transportation of that material and then deposition of the that material so this process is actually forms new landforms so primary surface processes are responsible for uh, uh, most topographic landform formations as i said and these include wind waves chemical dissolutions mass washing groundwater movement surface water flow glacial actions tectonism and volcanism so these are the agents actually those uh, uh, includes in the uh, geomorphic processes like uh, wind and waves are the uh, agents that uh, weather the rock type and then eroded uh, that rock type and uh, these winds and waves uh, and uh, uh, water is also involved in the transportations and deposition of the material see here this is the uh, landforms as you can see this landforms is uh, made in millions of years uh, uh, this is the original features as you can see the eroded this these are the eroded part types of geomorphic process so uh, there is uh, many type of uh, uh, geomorphic process by which the landforms is actually existed in earth or you can say the topographic landforms is forms by various uh, uh, geomorphic process the first one is eolian processes so eolian process means the activity of the winds wind can shape the surface of the earth in various size and shape like sand dunes and yard arms biological processes many living organisms shaping the landforms including uh, biogeochemical processes that control chemical weathering while uh, mechanical processes that control the mechanical processes like burrowing the uh, fluvial uh, process it means uh, rivers and stream is able to shape the land features they mobilize sediment and transport it downstream either as a uh, bed load suspended load or dissolved load the example of fluvial uh, process is delta bars and levees so as i said the water and river is uh, most important uh, uh, agents that uh, uh, able to form new uh, landforms in earth surface see here this is the sand dunes so this is a very important uh, eolian feature which is forms due to the wind actions as you can see next one is glacier process so a uh, gradual movement of ice down a valley causes abrasion and plucking of the underlying rock they forms various features on earth like moraine joseph valley fjord and hanging valley next one is uh, igneous processes so both volcanic and plutonic igneous process can have uh, important uh, uh, impacts on geomorphology and they can form various landforms in earth surface like localiths seals caldera so localith and seals are actually uh, uh, intrusive body igneous bodies while caldera is uh, uh, extrusive igneous uh, features that is formed due to the uh, volcanic eruptions so igneous process is also a uh, very important uh, uh, geomorphic process that uh, involve in the landforms uh, uh, formations next one is uh, tectonic processes 
Tectonic effects on uh, geomorphology can range from scales of millions of years to um, uh, minutes or less. It depends on underlying bedrock fabrics. Like earthquakes can create uh, many features on earth in uh, minutes or uh, less than uh, minutes. While uh, some other tectonic processes are that can uh, take up to millions of years to formation of new landforms like volcanic arc, mid oceanic ridges is forms in the millions of years due to the volcanic eruptions. See here this is the Fojard Valley which is forms due to the glacial actions or uh, glacial uh, processes. Marine processes. So marine processes are those associated with the action of waves, marine currents and seepage of fluids through the sea floor. The example of marine process is uh, sea caves and sea cliff. So this is also a very important uh, process that uh, uh, that can make uh, many landforms uh, near the seashore or uh, sea cliff. Geomorphologist and uh, role. So a geomorphologist studies the landforms of earth. They will also study how these landforms uh, forms and the history of specific landforms. In studying the history of landforms, geomorphologist can uh, predict changes that can take place in the future.